so it is official i'm now a member of the still brigade still steel 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 brigade still still steel whatever you call it the orange and uh, cream machines she's not a new one she's a used one it's not been used as a commercial machine it's only been used domestic um I picked it up last night. Um, these retail for about 270, 280, 280 around there, brand new. Um, I got the um, the vacuum kit with it as well. Got the bag and all the tubes that go with it. All the big uh, chunky tubes that go with the uh, leaf collection jobby. And uh, to be fair, the leaf collection kit on its own is £70, so you're looking at 350 quid for one of these with the leaf collection kit. <clears throat> She's a 2020-12 model. Um, i say it is in pretty decent nick. It's a little bit dirty but here and there, but nothing major. Um, used it the first time this morning. Um, it did feel a little bit wasn't quite you know running flat out if you like um but it does feel a lot smoother it does feel a lot smoother I've, I've, i'm basically upgrading from a mount field to this still so that is what we are doing um it does feel a lot smoother even though it wasn't running 100 percent. anyway since we've come home we've had a little tinker with the uh high screw and now it's running flat out and it is running perfecto um what was i going to say so yeah he's basically replacing the mount field which has been i've had this for two years didn't pay a lot for this 90 quid i think it was it was a um a refurbished one or a factory return one i think it was i had no problems with it it's always thought it's always been good um, this year it started to be a little bit slow on the first start up until it warms up and then it then it's then it's it's not too bad so it does need the carburetor i think having a look at and a clean and while i've purchased this we can have a look at that so at least we've still got a, a petrol leaf blower even though we do use battery mainly yes i know but you still need a, a petrol one you can't live without one it's unfortunate you can't um <clears throat> Yeah, it's supposed to have the easy start on it, the very light pull, anti-vibration system. But here's an interesting little, <clears throat> little thing, look. This is a genuine steel tube, okay? And this... Oh, he drops it. This is a genuine Mountfield tube. There's not a lot of difference between them, I'll tell you. It really isn't. And they both fit each other, so huh, how weird is that? Uh, that tube's hardly been used. I don't even think he's used the... Um... The other tube. Much. So it comes with... How bizarre is that? It actually comes with two two ends. Never knew that. So yeah, we've got two ends. Looks like this one's the one that's been used most. Looking at it. So yeah. So was it a bargain? Okay. Now I suppose it all depends on what you think a bargain is. Um, as I said, three hundred and fifty pounds. They are roughly with a, with the blower. And the um, leaf collection kit. The guy has actually said um, it's been on Aspen Fuel since it was new. He's never put anything else in it. It's always had Aspen Fuel in it. So he's, is that a good thing? Bad thing? I don't know. Probably good. Um, you certainly won't be getting Aspen Fuel in while I've got it. I'll tell you that for nothing. Um, so yeah, we are now a member of the uh, Still Brigade. Uh, 
SH86C. We paid, ready, drum roll, 150 pounds. Is that a bargain? What do you think? Let us know in the comments. Um, to me, I don't think that's bad. I think that's pretty decent. The plan is to get the mount field up and running again and sell that on. Hopefully get 80 quid for that. If we get 80 quid for that, then we've upgraded for 70 pounds. And if you think about it, the the, um, the collection kit's 70 quid. So really, you know, it's pretty cheap. It's a pretty cheap blow, isn't it? So yeah, still SH86C. I am now a member of the Steel Brigade. So yeah, that's it basically. I just thought I'd waffle on about it and tell you some stuff. Anyway, ciao.